seeing this today with the Prepper's uh, bookshelf, and I've got a book from uh, Robert Heinland, who, uh, you know, I love his books, uh, even though I did, reading his history, realize that he didn't get conservative until he married a conservative lady. Um, so, I, you know, when he married a liberal lady, he was a little liberal, so go figure. But anyway, I don't want to want to bash Heinlein because he's got some really great books. Here's a, a Prepper book. It's fiction. And he's got it labeled as science fiction's most controversial novel, and it and it kind of is. There are some racial overtones in this book. I don't really think he is racist, I guess. Um, but you know, basically the pre the 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 thing is, um, there was a global catastrophe, and the white race was blamed for causing it, and so. A thousand years later, basically, the white race was all slaves, and, you know, basically the black race, you know, was, was masters of the, uh, of the world, you know, whatever. But then there's a, uh, a nuclear holocaust back, you know, in present day, and he was in his storm shelter with his family, and for some reason, the, the ground zero, whatever, sent him to the future. And so here he is in the future with his storm shelter and he gets captured by you know the the people running the the world now and you know it's it's pretty interesting it has absolutely no useful you know anything as far as learning from it uh, but it is a it's a cool read and i tell you i did like one thing in the beginning where he talks about you know it's it's my shelter you know, I'm the boss, I let you stay, because he's got some, some, you know, his wife's kind of an alcoholic, and his kid's kind of useless, you know, and his kid's girlfriend's okay, you know, and his kind of butler guy's there, you know, and he's like, you know, are you going to be with me, or are you going to be against me, because I can't afford to, to, to watch you, you know, you can't second guess me, because I did this, and it's mine, and, and you're able to live because I worked, and if you're not going to follow my rules, you, you should leave. And I don't know how many of us could take that uh, stand there in a catastrophe. I know that I would probably try to. <laughs> but anyway, um, I enjoyed the book. Uh, it does make you a little uncomfortable, I guess, if, if you, uh, uh, you know, want to wanna get the race thing involved. But I did enjoy it, and I probably would recommend it. You know, there are some useful passages in it. But like I said, it's 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 science fiction. It was written to be a little controversial, um, you know. So whatever. So there you go. Farmers Freehold by Robert Hyman. Appreciate it. Thanks.